you know, I typically ask these questions because people, you know, they, they don't understand. Just like you said, I took, I took a major that really didn't matter much in undergrad yeah. and people think that they're locked into these things. You've gone on yeah. to do some amazing things in your career. And it just goes to show just because you don't necessarily know what you want to do early in your life, things change like this. So absolutely. Yeah. So I think, I think absolutely to bring those points out. I actually think it's the, I actually think it's almost even the opposite, which is if you know exactly where you're supposed to be at 21, I think something's wrong. There's no way for a 21 year old to know who they're supposed to be at 30, at 40, at 50, right? The best you can be is direct, directionally accurate and be pointed in the right direction, but then you just gotta be open to where and however spirit moves. You know, Tavio, I love that concept um, because it, it, man, man, we should stay on this for a second okay. <laughs> because people think that they're supposed, you know, people yeah. put so much pressure on themselves, right? That's right. They That's right. These high level executives, they look at these really successful people and they think I should know exactly what I want to do because obviously that person knew exactly what they wanted to do early on and they put this 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 undue pressure on themselves that's exactly right what do i want to do but you look at it the opposite you that's exactly right maybe it's not a bad thing not to know what you want to do at 21. yeah no i mean look if you're still chasing the same dream you had at 16 at 30 i think you owe it to yourself to do a deep dive right to make sure you're not on autopilot that young kid at 12, 13, 14, 15 definitely does not know who they're supposed to be, right? Um, so you got you to gotta do that self-check to make sure you're making new decisions. Even if it's the same decision, you got to make sure you're making new decisions. And so many of my friends who were set on the path from 16, 17, 18, a lot of them lawyers, some of them doctors, 35, 40, like hate their jobs, right? But they've oh been God. on that trajectory their whole time and now it's too difficult to go backward. I tell people all the time, look, your 20s is for exploring and figuring it out your 30s is when you like got to lock in and if you can lock in at 35 40 you have 20 25 years to be an expert and dangerous at something that you are good at and that you love as opposed to following some dream you had at 15 and landing in a career that you'll hate for the next 30 years Ooh, talk that talk the time <laughs> oh i love you are dropping such great points <laughs> What's up guys, thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love.